This morning we're going to be worming some cows and moving them around a bit and then later on we're going to be spreading some slurry and cleaning up that main cow shed but first of all we're going to put these cows through the crush and worm them. And through here is just where we line them up to go through and then we're injected and there's a door on the crush where we can open and get to them. And in these cows, we're gonna be getting just the ball. This is because we want to move it somewhere else. And then while we're moving it, we'll worm it anyway. But these cows will get wormed later on in the next few weeks. But for the minute, we're just gonna get the ball. able to film them going in but we are on the way now and they're all in the back here here are the cows that are already in this field and they come running down to the box since they know there's going to be some new ones in the field so let's let these out So we are now going to be taking slurry out of here. I'm gonna put the bucket on that first and then we'll get what we can out from there. Then scrape up, see the tractors over there. I'm gonna bring it down, reverse it to here. And yeah, let's go get it. Here it is, I'm gonna reverse it out of here and then we'll head down with it. Now in place, so I'm gonna move this tractor down to the machinery shed so I can drive out of there and then I'll put the attachment on skid steer and then we get a move on.
and that is completely full as you can see clearly so let's get this bad boy moving It is raining but we are here and that's our straw stored for winter and if you want to see us do that then I'll put it at the end of the screen so you can click it and watch that. Strain some straw but we are here to spread some slurry so there are cows in this field so I'm going to have to open the gate but once I'm in I'll be right with you. And here we are in the field. I'm not going to be able to fly my drone since it is raining, but I'll get the tractor in a second. Got the middle bit of this field to do, and then that'll be done. So, PTO on. And then we put the revs up to 540. There we are. We're going to start moving forward. And then. Ever so slightly release it. Since it's slurry, it will come up faster. So I'm going to drive it a little bit faster. Open it a tiny bit more. As you can see, that is a nice spread. Gotta be careful not to wheel spin since it is so wet. So this truck just don't mess around when it starts wheel spinning and it'll dig a massive hole. And that is exactly what you don't want. So when you turn, you gotta make sure the wind isn't blowing towards you because you don't want the slurry flicked all over the tractor. But yeah, that is now empty. We'll close the back turn down the revs, turn off the PTO but we're going to bring this back to the farm now load up another load and then we'll spread it tomorrow since it's going to be spread somewhere else but yeah, let's bring this back to the farm we're back again so I'm gonna scrape up and then put everything into here and then it will be cleaned out and this will be ready to go for tomorrow it started raining now unfortunately but I'm going to be going to scrape up all that in there and then we'll start loading again just finished scraping up and there's quite a lot again so I reckon we've got two more loads so let's get on with loading them now back down here again this load will finish off this field and then all the story will be done for the week and then it will be redone next week and just done that last strip so PTO and we are back on the farm now it's just going to stay here since as you can see the cows are coming across so that job is done and i hope you have enjoyed this video and the next video we will be taking some calves to the market and some other random things so i'll see you in the next one